it has been understood and taught that an ear should be over a shoulder, a shoulder should be over a hip, a hip should be over a knee, a knee should be over an ankle. And in other words, you have a verticality. What we teach to the prospective welfare is a picture, or in other words, a template of what a body should look like, how it should look. What are the relations within the body? Celeste Klein, and I am here because, well, I think that it's um, a great opportunity to do something new, get rid of some chronic pain that I have, and release some things. Apparently, I could, it's possible that I could release some things that haven't been able to be released. Okay, and tell me about the chronic pain. Oh, shoulders and neck. Okay. Forever. Okay. I think it's related to um, stress. I think it's a lot of stress. And I think it has something to do with, um, I know it has nothing to do with my rotator cuff. I can tell you that. It has something to do with some kind of stress that I'm carrying around in my shoulders. I think that I uh, feel that uh, I have a lot of people depending on me. And I'm okay during the day, I'm fine, but at night I get all tensed up because it comes into my head and I try to, you know, be in the moment. But I think that that's what a lot of it that is, uh, that I feel like I can't meet those obligations. It's too much. I just finished my 10th rolfing session and I was a bit skeptical. I didn't know what to expect, but I'll tell you that I just feel better. I don't know. I, it's hard to describe. I feel more present, more in the moment. Um, less anxiety, and just much more focused. And physically, I feel better. I feel taller. Um, I feel like I stand up straighter, um, more confident. Um, highly recommended. <laughs> Do you know how you were when you began? Well, I know I always had an underlying feeling of anxiety. Even though I always felt, you know, confident, but I always had that under feeling of, of doom, something was gonna happen next. But I, I don't feel that anymore. I feel like, you know, there's a lot of possibilities and anything can, anything can happen. And, you know, it's just, it's very good. And physically, I feel a lot better. I had a lot of aches and pains. Even though I, I'm not perfect, I still physically feel a lot better. I could do a lot more things that I couldn't do before. Perfect. Okay, why would you think other women should get rolfed? I think everybody should get rolfed. Women are not, because I think that, it, I don't know what it does exactly, I really don't have a handle on exactly what it does, but it does make you feel better. However, whenever, whatever you're not feeling good at, whatever aspect in your life you're not feeling good, I think it'll make it better. In 1975, Robert Toporek, an advanced certified Rolf practitioner, began studying directly with Dr. Ida P. Rolf, the founder of Rolfing. Since then, over 5,000 men, women, and children have benefited from his magic hands. His clients have transformed their posture, tension, stress, flexibility, confidence, self-expression, and much more. Robert studied and worked closely and directly with Dr. Rolf for the last four years of her life. He traveled around the country with her, attended conferences, provided administrative help, sponsored her 81st birthday, took her to the movies, and assisted in whatever she wanted or needed. 